In 2015, the United States Supreme Court's landmark decision in Obergefell v. Hodges recognized a constitutional right to civil marriage for same-sex couples. Since the Obergefell holding, states have grappled with its implications on related areas of law, such as common law marriage, parental rights, and adoption. In Pavin v. Smith, the Supreme Court weighed in on Obergefell's scope as it addressed the constitutionality of an Arkansas parentage law. Arkansas law stated that for the purpose of registering a birth, a child's mother was the woman who gave birth to the child. The law also provided that when a married woman gave birth, her husband must be listed as the child's father on the birth certificate. This law applied even if the child was conceived by artificial insemination using an anonymous sperm donation. Two same-sex married couples, Lee and Jana Jacobs, and Tara and Marissa Paven, each decided to have a child using an anonymous sperm donation. Each couple listed both spouses as the child's parents on the application for their newborn's birth certificate. But the Arkansas Department of Health issued birth certificates recognizing only each child's birth mother as the child's parent. Both couples sued the director of the Arkansas Department of Health, seeking a declaration that the state's birth registration law was unconstitutional post Obergefell because it denied same-sex couples a spousal benefit available to opposite-sex couples. The trial court held that the law was unconstitutional. The Arkansas Supreme Court reversed, holding that the law was constitutional because its focus was the biological relationship between a child and each parent, rather than the relationship between spouses. The United States Supreme Court granted cert.